I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today, we're going to learn about combining like terms. And we're going to simplify each expression. So, if I was given this expression, negative 7 times n plus 3 minus 8 times 1 plus 8n. Okay? The first step I'm actually going to do here, okay, is make that minus be plus negative, because I know when I start distributing, I prefer adding a negative to distribute than minus and dealing with that. So I have negative 7 here, n plus 3, and then plus a negative 8 times 1 plus 8n. Okay? So let's start distributing, right? Distribute the, the 7 and the 8. So negative 7 times n is negative 7n. Negative 7 times 3 is negative 21, plus negative 8 times 1 is negative 8, plus negative 8 times 8n is a negative 64n, okay? So now I have negative 7n plus negative 21 plus negative 8 plus negative 64n. Let's rearrange and put our like, uh, like terms first, right? So negative 7n first plus a negative 64n, got that one there, plus a negative 21 plus a negative 8. A lot of negatives in here, right? A lot of negatives. So, let's combine our like terms here. Well, what's negative 7n plus a uh, negative 64, okay? Well, a negative 7n plus a negative 64 is a negative 71n plus, here, negative 21 plus a negative 8 comes out to be negative 29, right? Two negatives added together is a larger negative, and same thing here, two negatives added together is a larger negative. Well, Plus a negative can look cleaner, subtraction, so we have negative 71 and minus 29, and that is our final answer. So let's recap. This was a large one. Negative 7 distributed to so negative 7 times n, uh, which was negative 7n, and negative 7 times 3 is negative 21. The minus 8 I made to plus a negative 8, so I distributed that. Negative 8 times 1 is negative 8. Negative 8 times positive 8 is a negative 64n. Kept the plus signs in between. Using the commutative property, I rearranged this to have all our um, like terms together. So we have negative 7n plus a negative 64n. And then the plus negative 21 plus negative 8, and all four parts were brought down to the next level, which is great next step. And we combined it. Negative 7n plus a negative 64n, which is a negative 71n. And then negative 21 plus negative 8 is a negative 29. Okay? Well, adding a negative is the same thing as subtraction, and that looks cleaner. And so our final answer, our clean looking final answer, is negative 71n minus 29.